So about everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today I want to share with you a quick video that I did at CES 2017 and it was a demo of a Ryzen running system against an Intel system at transcoding gameplay and basically posting it using OBS directly to Switch. And it's basically seeing how well these two systems can run head to head. This is TK and let's go ahead and check out the demo. Guys, we're going to take a look at a real quick demo here. Um, both systems that we're looking at right now are pretty much almost identical with the exception of the CPU and the motherboard architecture. On the left, we have the i7 core 6900K unlocked turbocharge. Um, on the right side, we have the Ryzen CPU running on the Zen architecture motherboard with AMD. Um, and what we're looking at, of course, is four sets of monitors. The two bottom monitors are reflective of the system on the right and the system on the left, both replaying a, uh, a final match of Dota 2 and both rendering the system, uh, well, taxing the system as if you're playing the game. One of the main benefits that we're looking here, especially with the new Ryzen architecture, is the ability to streamline and optimize streaming, especially if you're trying to stream your game online. Now, as you notice here, we're launching uh, OBS on both systems just to show you guys now how fast you're able to run it. Now, the top back monitors that you're looking at are the end users experience streaming it from Twitch. They're receiving the video feed, and we're going to notice how fast the Ryzen architecture is able to get it. And right there, you saw it less than about 15 seconds. You're able to get this, uh, the OBS screen showing up. So the end user get to see it. On the left side, Intel is still lagging. Uh, from what I understand, it takes up almost about a minute and the refresh rate is a little bit low. And just to let you guys know, OBS is encoding at the highest quality possible to be able to transmit this. And it's doing it real time on one system. You don't need to have two computers, one for gaming, one for encoding and, and streaming. You can run all of it at this point, all within the same system, the same box. And I'm still talking to you guys, and it still didn't come up on the left side. So I'm going to stop talking the moment you see it on the left side, and that'll be the end of this demo. But Ryzen's right there. It's proven. Uh, it's running some uh, development hardware right now, so it's definitely very exciting. It's going to be available in the Q1 um, for the consumer to be able to buy it online and definitely get a really good experience running on some really nice AMD hardware. And it's finally there. About a minute later, uh, Intel shows it up there. Again, it's not a really big thing for you guys if you don't realize how much the delay is different here from 15 seconds to a minute. So definitely very appreciated. 